When we've had a good long summer with heat, we oftentimes get a really great crop of sunflowers and oftentimes we'll get a lot of height to those tall stems. But in the fall, when the flowers have begun to wilt, they'll tip over on the stem and begin to dry out on their own. It's time to get out there and harvest those before the seeds begin to fall out on their own. In order to collect the seed heads, you can cut a sh real short stalk or you can leave some of the stalk on the seed head. We're gonna place it into a brown paper bag so that as those seeds dry, they will fall loose in the brown paper bag and you can collect them. Once you get them collected into the bag, you can tie a string around that bag and suspend it in your garage or in your basement so that it will dry inside the bag and the seeds will only fall where you can collect them. If you're planning to do craft projects throughout the winter, you'll want to keep those seeds attached to the seed head so that you can put those into uh, different kinds of bird feeders or wreaths that the birds can feed on through the winter months or to use them just to uh, have dried sunflower seeds that you can eat with your family. I'm Donna Hoffman with the University of Wyoming Extension and you're watching From the Ground Up.